Heinz. Hello, welcome to a nighttime edition of Homework. Uh, I know everyone still you are quarantining very deep in good. So students, where are the schools? Well, here perhaps is a small school. It's me, Flula. Uh, I am answering uh, some questions for you guys, some homework. Let us jump to it very quick. Uh, this one is from Jena uh, and it's about circles. Circle, circles. So let's check it out. <clears throat> Imagine doing the following with a piece of paper. Oh, wow. When you say this, it's so exciting. What will we do? Will we build a steamship? Or perhaps, I don't know, recreate like Woodstock? No, we just got to draw a circle. Okay, cool. I'm in. That is fine. Okay, so let's do it. We draw a circle with radius six inches and cut off one third of the circle. You see it, but I will draw it here as well. Snippy dippy bingy bunky. And so we have like this, snip, okay. And then we know the radius, or equals six. Yes, okay, we will say inches. So we have it with a dotty. Okay, now, question. Use the remaining part of the circle to form a cone, where the center of the circle is now the point of the cone. Okay, I have cheated a little bit. Uh, so I have cut this, this, this man before, yeah? Now we take it, and we now make it into a cone. So if we go like this, Bop. And now look, oh, it's a cone. Let me draw it for you so it would look like this. Yeah, and then bop, 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 bop. So we have made this cone. Okay, now the question. What is the surface area of the cone without the base area? Not base like base in your face. Wrong, wrong one. It is... The base is uh, this part, this bottom, the bottoms of the cone. So if the cone here, if the cone was having a flat section here, bop, 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 this would be the base area. We are just wanting this part, this paper. So how do we find the surface area of this? First, I know not first, we are now deep into this, but first let us write some equations that maybe will help us for circles. Number one, if you would like to know the area of a circle, it is just pi or square. And just, just memorization this, it's good to know. And then the next one also is the circumference, which is two pi or. And what is circumference? It is this journey. If you like to make a nice circle journey like this, doodly bop, that would be the circumference. And or is the radius, which is the center dot into any place in the edge. This is always the same, 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 same. And the area is just pi, of course, 3.14 times r squared. Very quick question, what is pi? Oh, haha, I will tell you. If we have a circle here, Snoopy, and we have something going across here. So this is the diameter, diameter, which is just two radiuses. If you could take this length and just wrap it around a circle, it would wrap around 3.14159 snippy dappy dippy dappy boops. And that is the number pi. It is irrational, which meaning it go all over directions. But that is pi. Okay, returning. We have now our equations. So now we answer. What is surface area of the cone without the base area? So that is this, this man, or this, just this, yeah? So how do we find the area of a, of a circle? Boom, pi r squared. So we know it's pi r squared, but it is not all. It is all but one third. So this means there is two thirds remaining. So the area is two thirds times pi times r squared. Yeah, and so now we know this is area equal two over three. And what I like to do is I like to bring in the numbers, which is a six and it is squared. So six squared over one, you will see why I like this, times pi, because you can go two over three times six times six over one times pi, and then you can make a little reduction, just like the gravy. Uh, so six and three, bop, bop, two, because three go into six, two, so you can make a reducey doosies. So they have a cross, two times two is four, times six, 24. So, 24 over 1, which is the same as just 24 pi inches squared. Why squared? Because r 
we had to square it. And when R is inches, which it was, it was six inches squared. This is then 36 inches times inches. So this is inches squared. So this is our A, what is surface area of cone? B, this is R. Okay, B, calculate the radius of the base of the cone. What is the base of the cone? Well, it is this portion that is down here. And we need to find the radius of this. Oh, what is that? I don't know. Do not worry. They always give you all the infos. So let us remember something. What is the circumference of this cone right here? Well, if you just go like this, boop, the circumference of the cone is just this, which is the circumference of your circle minus one third of the circumference. So let us return. What is circumference? Two pi or? Excellent. So to find this, bumpy, 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 this is uh, uh, the, the circumference in for us will be two over three times two over one for fun is two pi or two pi times or which is six yeah and now we can just go like this and we say two times two is four two times four is 24 because we like to make over one yeah 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 two, 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 two. two times two times six is 24 over three pi do you see it because three times one times one is three two times two times six is 24. And now look, 24, 3. Oh, we can make it more easy. 3 into 24 is 8. Sorry, 8 pi. But inches, inches, because we did not make a square. Z. So what we have now is the circumference of this new cone. We need to find radius. So guess what we have? We already know an equation where we know circumference, which is this and this 8 pi. 8 pi equals the circumference uh, is 2 pi r, right? Because circumference is 2 pi r, because we look for the new r here. So look at this, 8 pi, 2 pi r. So we can, when this is multiply, you can always divide and divide by both sides. Now, when you do it, what you get is, this goes, the pi's go away, and then 8 or 2 is 4 equal r. Hey, hey, oh, oh, that is the radius of the base of the cone. Excellent. And it's inches, of course, inches. Got to write those units. Okay, now see. See, we have a little room now. Calculate the area of the base of the cone. Easy. How do we find area for a, a base, which is a circle? Yeah. It's pi r squared. And we know our or we have just found. So now area equal pi times or squared, which is four inches squared. Now, four times four, 16, inch times inch, inch squared. So A equals 16 pi inch squared. Now, they are saying here, use 3.14 for pi. Okay, fine, make a calculate and blah, 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 blah. But I like to make it like a pi because it's nice and clean and tasty. So, booyah. And there you have it. Here is how to find some surface area and thing of cone and circle and stuffy doves. You're welcome, Jena. <laughs> Homework. Ooh, send me your works on Instagram or Facebook. I don't understand technology, but send it to me. Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye. Homework. Send it to me. Homework.